Welcome to Fox News is the Point. I am your host, Marjorie Taylor Greene. First, we are going we are going to talk about a, wi- a wide range of topics. But first, this first topic. Is AOC hiding in their house right now? Maybe that's the reason why my house keeps getting swatted every day. Back to the usual news. Today, a California judge released the police body cam in the Paul Pelosi attack. Now, this whole attack, I understand how it all happened. It was obviously a gay affair. I mean, it is obvious. Both men were found at the front door in their underwear. Now, that's not something very unusual. The next thing you know, the guy hits him in the face with a hammer. Does that seem a little unusual? Here's the fo- here's the footage. Let's take a look. Hey, y'all, how are you doing today? Sir, who is this man? Uh, I don't know who he is. My name's David. Oh, uh, his name is David. Uh, I don't know him. I don't know this guy at all. Sir, could you please drop the hammer? No. Sir, drop the hammer. Hey, 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 hey. What? I'm sorry, what? Oh. Sorry, everyone. Apparently, earlier today, Fox News showed the complete explicit version of this. And so we had to cut away from it before, you know, the big hit. (laughs) Um, yeah, so that was it. They showed the uh, footage. All right, joining me now is Judge Janine and Tucker Carlson. Judge Janine, hello. Where's Tucker? I have no idea. He said he was going to be running late because of his show. So it could take a little bit. All right. So, Judge Janine, what are your thoughts on this tape? Actually, this body cam footage. Sorry. Well, it's very disturbing, Marjorie. Because the next thing we know, we see these two guys, one of them in their underwear, one of them that's possibly in their shorts. Both of them are holding on to a big hammer, possibly the speaker's gavel, And then the next thing, bam, whack to the head. Insane. Yes. Thank you, Judge Janine. We're going to have to cut our interview with you right now for time for the other topics. Okay. All right, now we are going to talk about the recent classified documents incidents that have been going on this month. Earlier this month, President Biden, so-called our president, we learned to, that he has had in his possession 20 classified documents at his former office and his home in Delaware. Yeah. In Delaware, a state where people wear underwear. Hey, that rhymes. I'm going to have to use it as an anti-Biden slogan. (laughs) And recently, former Vice President Mike Pence was found with classified documents. Joining me now is the one who started this whole classified documents thing. My favorite president, Donald John Trump. Hello, America. It's your favorite president. Hello, Marjorie. Glad to be on the show. All right. So, what is your reaction to the classified documents incidents in the past mo- few months? Well, I think it's pretty shocking that a whole bunch of documents were taken unlawfully and wrongfully. 
but do you take full responsibility for taking the classified documents that you took? Oh, oh, I didn't. None of those documents were never classified. Um, you know, I just, uh, you know, declassified them before I left office. And then just took them all to Mar-a-Lago. Like the good president I was. Mm -hmm. But do you think the whole Biden scandal is an accident? No, it wasn't an accident. This whole thing was purposefully. How about the Pence thing? Also purposefully. And you taking classified docu documents? Purpose, I mean, rightfully, I did that the right way because those documents, they were classified. You mean declassified. Oh, uh, yes, declassified. And you agree Merrick Garland should treat Joe Biden the way you're, he's treating you right now? I mean, he already is. He's appointed a special counsel. I mean... He's pretty much treating treating him like he is to me. All right. I think we're just going to stop here. I'm Marjorie Taylor Green. Thank you for watching. Ingram Angle's next.